there's a glitch to make your cephalopod look like this. Go to the Weapons tab and sort it by sub. Then hover over the Sprinkler tab with your cursor. Then you need to press the left, right, and down D-pad buttons at the same time. If done correctly, your cephalopod should now be holding the Splash-O-Matic. Now, head to the bottom and select a weapon without a name. Then go to Headgear, sort by brand, and go to the Forge tab. Now do the same thing with the D-pad, left, right, and down buttons all at once. Then select a piece of headgear from the bottom without a name. Then go to clothes and keep it sorted by brand. Go to the Tony Kensa tab and once more do the button pressing with the D-pad. Select a piece of gear without a name. Then go to Shoes and hover the cursor over the Tente Tech tab. Do the same D-pad button combination and select the piece of gear without a name. After that, I'd recommend hovering your cursor over the other tab so it won't automatically equip you with shoes. Then press the minus button on the Joy-Con and register the fit into a slot. And there you go. Your very own cephalopod without required clothing. This does work for both inklings and octolings, male or female as well.